Hi guys, welcome to Abjada. So in this one, we are going to learn how to do this to-do app using Svelte. Now, we are going to use Firebase as our backend and uh, we are going to have a login for users and they will have their own sessions of to-dos. I'm going to show that right away. But I want you to subscribe to the channel so that you get the regular updates of this series. So this will be a complete CRUD app which will have all the functionalities of uh, create, read, update, and delete. Now, I'm gonna show you how it works. I'm gonna go to this authentication. There are no users yet. I'll log in with GitHub maybe. Now, once I finish logging in, so it will show a pop-up and it will show, for the first time it will show like, you know, uh, whether you gonna authorize. For me, it's not showing because, you know, this is not the first time I'm doing it. Now, yes, so my, uh, um, this user has come up. This is, this is my user uh, email. Uh, so BUP68 something. Now there are no to do's here. This is the app. Um, now, once I start adding the to do's, let's say I add get milk. Um, soon after that, it should create a collection of users and then add that user uh, with the same ID, something like BUP or something, right? Yeah, BOP68. So this has added a document. This is a collection, user collection. This is a document. And then there is another collection, which is a sub collection. And that has a document. And that will have get milk. So I'll tell you why this is so. Uh, because different users can have different, uh, you know, uh, documents of their own. So the data won't mix. Now, get milk is false. I'll add more. Uh, get bread. You can see on the right side as soon as I hit enter, it will come up there. Right now, I'll add get x maybe that also comes up. Now, imagine I'm done getting milk. I click on that and it will cross off here and it will also show is complete true for this. I can do the same thing for maybe x if I click on that, that becomes true. Now, this is for one user. I'm going to log out. I'm going to log in with Google. Now, when I log in with Google, uh, here you see that users has only one document, which is BUP. And also here we have only one user. Okay, we have two because I logged in. Uh, this is IKRF. Okay, I go to Firestore now. And I see that there is only one document so far. So I'll add task one or something. And if I refresh here, we should get that IKFR something uh, document. Document with that ID. Yeah. So one KRF. Okay. We got that. We have to do in that. And we have uh, the task one. Now I'll add one more. Task two. Uh, task three. <clears throat> now imagine task one is finished. I click on it and then it's, it's done. Now, this is how it works. I can log out and log back into the GitHub one where uh, we had this. So that will still be there. So this is how the app works. I will leave the link in the description. You can also try that out. Now, um, I'll be leaving regular videos on uh, how to do this. This will be a longer series, but I think uh, you will get to learn a lot here. So yeah, guys, hit a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.